but I thought someone else. All right, what's going on guys? So I thought I'd give you guys a house tour as we recently just got a house. From the outside and from the inside, it is just like any other modern estate house in Australia, but we're gonna do a lot with it. So I thought I'd show the inside. We just moved in, so stuff's everywhere, but let's get it. So pretty much the main reason we moved here was for productivity. So I moved in with Will, I moved in with Hayden, and yeah, it's pretty uh, pretty lonesome here. We're just out here grinding, so. I'll show you the most important thing first. It's a little bit of a sneak peek, guys. So this is basically the reason I've been missing for a bit because I've just been setting this up. This is gonna be the 1% podcast and um, we've already spent like three or 4K on it. New microphones, new cameras, new furniture. All sorts of equipment. We've got condenser mics. Um, this is only the beginning. We've got heaps more lighting to put all around it. But yeah, this is really like the new chapter for us. So yeah, the aim of this podcast will basically to be making it the biggest self-improvement podcast in Australia. That's sort of just a little goal I've set in my head. But it's going to be absolutely nuts. I've already done heaps with it. I've already done test episodes, and they've already done pretty well. So got heaps of good guests lined up. We're not always going to have guests on, but when we do, it's going to be epic. But yeah, that's just the tiniest little bit of a sneak peek I can give you guys. That's really just going to be like the new chapter for us in here. This is literally just the master bedroom. So this is a four bedroom house and we decided all three of us, we'd get the even sized rooms and then just make this one potty room. And then in here is technically the ensuite. This is definitely the ensuite. We've got to sort out all of this. So in here is like so much equipment that we've built up over the past couple of years. We've got drones, we've got stabilizers, projectors, microphones, all sorts of cables. There's probably about fucking three, four grand's worth of stuff just sitting here. This is all the youth market stock. So what I'm wearing right now is a youth market vintage tee, youth market vintage sweater, sorry. There's only a few of these left. Most of the stuff, if you go on the youth market website is sold out, but this is one of the very few things that isn't sold out and it's pretty sick. I like it, it's one of my favorite items, but yeah. They're all just in these bags at the moment. This isn't all of the stock. This is just some of it. We've got to get racks. Put them up all on the racks. So yeah, we fulfill everything from here in the house and it's all designed, made by us. It's legit clothing. It's not some drop shipping bullshit. It's legit stuff. So let's get to the not so exciting stuff, which is basically just where we live and whatnot. The laboratory. So this is where Hayden and Will have their setups. So here we have Hayden. He's got his fidget spinner. Haven't seen these since 2012, but yeah, another camera. But yeah, this is basically where we've been making content, like someone will be in charge of editing, filming. We've already got a cameraman for the potty, so there's gonna be someone behind the scenes doing all the different clips, pulling stuff up. So it's it's gonna be proper legit. And um, yeah, Will script in a video, obviously. Hayden's editing his gym stuff. So it's a pretty autistic household. It's just making stuff really like, it's virgin activities only here, really. All right, this is Will's bedroom. All right, so here, this is this is what Will's on, if you guys know. So these are concoction steroids. This is Will Harley's stack, by the way, guys. Holy shit. Ashwagandha, Tonka Ali, multivitamin, magnesium, Omega Brain, fucking vitamin D, all these colognes. Subscribe to Will Harley, boys. I've got a little bit of a stack. It's not that intense, but you can literally buy a hack yourself, boys. If you feel like shit, you can literally just get all this stuff and you can feel like, like a lot better. You can perform better in the gym and whatnot. So I don't see why you wouldn't do it. Um, oh, there's another, another camera there as well. We got so many cameras here. This is Hayden's room. So not a lot of stuff goes on in Hayden's room, to be honest. It's... um. Yeah, it's very bleak and pretty grim in Hayden's room. It's all just... What's, what's, what supplements are Hayden? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, what supplements has he got? What's what he got here, mate? Multivitamin, ashwagandha, we've got some tape, some vitamin D. Some all stuff for sleep, so what's all going on here? This I really like. And also he's got a butt plug just sitting there. This one goes out to all the haters. Nah, you were so good, mate. I don't remember. Mine sounded better. Fuck man, that's beautiful. That is, that is absolutely fucking beautiful. Good thing we don't give a fuck. So here's the bathroom, guys. Yeah, so bathroom is just standard stuff. I've actually been on the skincares recently, so I've got a few little things. It's nothing major, but so yeah, I recently got on the skincares because I realized I look way older than I am. My skin was deteriorating, so I'm starting to repair that now, which is which is good. But this is my room. This is where, like, I don't really do much here. I make love and I sleep and that's about it. Supplement stack, Tonka Ali, Ashwagandha, Fidoja Agrestis, Vitamin D. I literally just sleep in this room. Pretty average. Now, this is where we get a protein. So this is the kitchen, boys. We're gonna be probably doing a lot of meal prep videos here. It's a decent sized kitchen, bit of area there, gas stove and whatnot. We literally meal prep for the entire week for all three of us. So how many tubs is there? Like at the start of the week, how many tubs have we got in here? We've got 60 fucking tubs in here at the start of the week and then we don't cook for the rest of the week. It's pretty epic. We don't even go to the shop, right? It's all productivity here, optimization. Um, we've got a few tubs left in here, but yeah, it's pretty bleak. Nothing flavorsome in here. Just fucking eggs, protein, meat. And this, this is the most autistic thing. We don't even have a fucking couch. We don't even, we don't even watch this to be honest, boys. Um, we really don't. This is just stuff we took from the other house and put here. We haven't even watched this yet. We don't watch TV. 
TV. We literally just jerk each other. I mean, can make content and have a good time. All right, now this, this is something special. So, oh boy, so I'm not really supposed to tell you this story, but it's pretty funny. So tell me if that's how you spell supplement. <laughs> this has been in the works for months, <laughs> probably like three or four months. Yeah, that's gonna be eventually soon, actually, hopefully, because we found the flavors for it. So pre-workout is coming, boys. Our own fucking pre-workout. Backyard. This is all right. And I get heaps of messages all the time. Yo, do you, uh, what investments do you, do you have dividends in stocks? Do you have Bitcoin? I literally invest in cactus. So this was about 30 centimeters when I bought it, boys. So it was only, it was about here and I purchased it for $50. Um, and it's literally grown double in size in just a couple of months. I don't have to water it. I don't have to do anything with it. So eventually I want to own a cactus farm, get fucking heaps of cactuses and just like, I could probably sell this for probably like $100, $120 now. So it's pretty epic. That is just raising my incomes. A few other little succulents here, but we're actually getting a spa this weekend, hopefully. So that's going to be sick when I have a spa here. And all of us three guys are going to chill in it, naked as fuck. Backyard. So we actually got this house. This house spawned in the end of the game. This is the end of the map. This is as far as it goes. You know in GTA 5, whatever, it's the end of the map. This is it. <laughs> oh my. So yeah, this is our backyard. It's actually pretty sick. Um, these modern houses usually don't come with a massive backyard, but this one we're pretty blessed with, so... When I first got this house, I feel like my testosterone levels were like a fucking all time high. I was just like strutting back and forth. I was like, I purchased a piece of land. This is my kingdom. This is my empire. So I was just pacing up and down for days on end. I didn't even sleep, bro. And then, yeah, we've got all this. Are you coming out or what? But yeah, we've got more grass here over there, so. And um, on the end of that is literally just nothing. It's an empty void. There's like literally nothing exists out of that. This little thing that we call life, this side of that wall, so. So yeah, obviously guys, I've been absent for like a month or two. Um, but I haven't gone anywhere. I'll never go anywhere. Holy shit. Oh my God. Anyway, I'll never go anywhere, boys. If I've been missing, I'm leveling up. So this is going to be my level up because I'm really trying to take off this year. I'm not trying to fuck around. And this is literally pretty much the reason we got the house. Well, the reason I got the house anyway was just to make content. So that's how much I'm fucking destined for this shit. But we actually got a, oh, this is my setup by the way in this corner here. I can really just get into a deep workflow in this little corner. Like there's nothing that's distracting me. I can close that door, put in those blinds and I can just get invested in whatever I'm making, which is pretty cool. But this will be where Lockie sits, which will be our guy for um, changing the angles and cam there'll be three camera angles for this podcast. So someone's got to change them. Someone's got to bring up clips. Someone's got to bring up fact checks and all that stuff. And he'll be sitting here. There'll be a weekly podcast at the same time the same day, every week, probably every, I think we'll release it every Friday, most likely at 6 p.m., but that might change. But yeah, this is where he changes levels of the microphones. I don't know, boys, I'm just fucking proud of this. I'm proud of this shit, boys. I'm proud of this room. We're gonna have like a 1% LED sign here, and there's a lot more we wanna do with it lighting-wise and a few little things, but hopefully in the next two weeks, we can get all the test episodes done and we can start just popping out the videos. We even, we're even getting new editing programs to step up the editing. Like, they'll be fully edited, like professional shows, just like you see on fucking TV. Um, even better. But yeah, basically Hayden got a new setup. So you got a whole new PC, whole new desk. And we've basically like adopted it. adopted him as like a content machine. So he works for us now. $5 an hour is like, oh, yeah. nah, he's got his own thing going. Check him out. Instagram right here. And just for the record, guys, Hayden is on steroids. So no, nah, but in dead seriousness, guys, Hayden's got like trend twins genetics and he's not even on steroids. Like just say mum's life. Say mum's life. Say, say mum, say mum's life. I'm not on steroids. Mum's life. I'm not on steroids. You heard it here in first, boys. So, uh, yeah, and Hayden's literally been training for a year, which is fucking ridiculous. Yeah, that's why basically we've adopted him. L little trend twins, goblin, con uh, yeah. content <laughs> producing. <laughs> <laughs> um, by the way, guys, this is how I get my internet. So I literally routed, this is dodgy as, but I'm gonna fix it. Routed it from the computer, around here, around here, on the wall. Yeah. We're gonna fix this up and make it look better, but <laughs> up along the fucking roof, along here, and then into the garage where we all plug our content machines into this modem here. See so guys, that's really all you need to see. That's the new house. The goal of this house was purely just optimization and to make make this shit work for us because um, recently we were, previously we were so far away. We were living out in Gippsland, if you, guys, if you guys know where that is. And we were driving an hour to go to gym, an hour to do everything. It was just, to get to civilization, it was it took forever. And um, so yeah, now we can just sit here, we can grind. We can make so much content because we have so much time now. We have a place where we're all together. We can work on things. Podcasts out every week. These guys will be pushing content out as well. And um, the goal is just, 
just to really blow up in the sort of fitness self-improvement niche and just make it cool because I feel like self-improvement isn't cool. It's sort of like it's it's frowned upon. Like you know when you you know when you look up like a self-improvement video, but you don't want your mates to see it because it's not like you don't want to be made fun of or whatever. I want to change that completely. So I want to make it cool. I want self-improvement to be like a, a thing where everyone can come together and you know help themselves out. So yeah, that's basically the goal with the podcast. And I call it a podcast, but it's gonna be more of a show. It's not really gonna be like a podcast. I will put it out on Spotify like the full episodes, but they'll be like fully edited shows with guests and all sorts of um, editing. But yeah, I'm not gonna talk about it. I'll wait till you see it because notice how I haven't really talked about this much. I've just been doing it and that's how you guys should approach your goals and what you wanna do. Literally just do it. Don't fucking, you don't have to tell anyone about it or do anything like that. And um, you can follow my Instagram here if you wanna get more updates on it. I'm always posting on there. That's where I post mainly. My TikTok banned. I've just, I'm basically just calling it quits on TikTok. I know like I got like 133K or something on TikTok and I built up an audience there, but I'll just create a new account. I really don't give a fuck boys. Cause it's like, what do you do now? I've appealed it like five times. Like I'm over just getting banned and shit. Like they, they have an agenda and they don't want um, men to improve. So we'll find other platforms and we, we prevail. I'll see you boys in the next video. Um, I'll be posting a lot more obviously. So yeah, catch you later.